Penelope Curry here. Now, all this week we'll be cogitating on the not inconsiderable fashion dilemma on whether pink polka dots have become the new blue horizontal stripe. <laughs> Lots of food for thought there. But first, sit back and endure. <laughs> I mean, sit back and enjoy Jules Hobbs with her regular Edinburgh Monologue Marathon update. <sighs> of course, you can always take this opportunity to pop out and put the kettle on. <laughs> Hello, Jules. Hello, Penelope. How lovely to be here. Mm. And actually, to be All right, in now, the same studio. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> We've started. Right, so I've observed over the last few weeks, Jules, that you're not the slightest bit interested in fashion. So, if you can just give us your update and then make a sharp exit, because I wouldn't want you to feel that you had to stay around till the end of my show. Mm. Right. Lovely. Thank you. So, <clears throat> um, if I can just speak to the nation here, who I know listen to the Penelope Curry show, um, thank you all so much for your continued warmth and support, which is amazing. Uh, the, the fund to help us get us to Edinburgh keeps going up and up and up. And I'm delighted to say that we are getting now uh, almost to the point where we're embarrassed. So thank you so much for your generosity. And more than that, as I said last week, your moral support. If you would still like to join our Monologue Marathon family, you can do so by visiting www.findingthewill.com the crowdfunding page, you'll see it clearly marked on there. Click on that and then you'll find all the information you need on the six shows that we are taking to Edinburgh. That's Richard Curno and I together taking those six shows to Edinburgh. And also you'll see a link for how you too could be part of the family by uh, donating and supporting us. And the live streams will definitely be going ahead. Oh, how marvellous. <laughs> yes, isn't yes. it? Yes, well, thank you, Jules. But once again, we've run out of time. Oh. Now, I have noticed that my advice, whether it be on plumping cushions, pesto recipes or polka dots, count for naught when you start banging on about the lack of goodness knows what in your Edinburgh monologue malarkey. Personally, I can't wait until you're well and truly kick-started north of the border. <laughs> Preferably on a one-way ticket. Oh, I don't mince my words, no. Now, roll on August, I say. Until next week, it's goodbye from... What's her name here? And it's goodbye from me, Penelope Curry, on the Penelope Curry Show. <laughs> goodbye! I've just rung the bell. You don't do it after I've rung the bell.